I couldn't help but notice your pain. My pain? It runs deep. Share it with me. Welcome back to Crusader Kings 2, Game of Thrones mod. We are back as Lord Anies of Harrenhal. Uh, last time we left off, I left off at, we were at age 14, and I said I didn't know if I was going to go ahead. Nothing was really happening, so I went ahead uh, up until the day he doesn't have to have a regency anymore. So now we got the event, our 16th birthday has just happened. We, um, regency is now over, so now we're an adult, we can actually do things. So, I figure better time, no better time than now to start from uh, where we left off pretty much. Yeah, two years went by, a couple things happened. Um, let me see. So, this dragon, right, his rider was some regular woman. She ended up dying, so the dragon flew off. Ended up getting tamed by some random Dothraki genius. And I didn't realize at the time that... Being genius gives you a 200% chance of taming dragon. I, I didn't realize at first. And now quick gives you like 35%. It's so real low. But I guess his genius and uh, I think nothing else. Yeah, just his genius ability was able to uh, tame the dragon. Now the dragon had an egg that didn't hatch yet. So the person who got the egg was the triarch of Volantis at the time. Not that guy. But this guy, Anor the Black, he tried to hatch the egg. He didn't kill himself, but he killed a lot of other people in the process. He killed his uh, his wife here, um, two random unsullieds, and uh, somebody else. So there goes the egg. So that happened. Um, we were made a knight by a septon at the age of 14. Like literally a couple weeks after in game time after I like, let it go for a little bit. So, we became a knight at 14, so we were a master at arms at, what, 13, 12, 13, something like that. Uh, we still are a master at arms. We're now an adult. It was funny because I was saying we were training troops in River Run at the same time as being, uh, whatever, tutored by our guardian at Heron Hall. Oh, and also at Heron Hall... I've basically just been using the money that we've been saving because we don't have to use it for anything really on building up stuff. So I have been building some stuff. Uh, we also got work is faster by four. So that one work slower by two actually is now like canceled out. So it's actually like we're having work faster by two just because we have the one negative. So at least it's going ahead of schedule, which is nice. So hopefully sometime soon this should be done uh if it goes by most improvements that are like 40 years roughly hopefully that'll be the time frame that this one happens so all right regency and lord Anies, i have to deal with this guy because he was the guy that was stealing money from me uh so i don't know what i'm gonna do with him yet i can't just oh i can't imprison him i think that's what we're gonna do straight up because he was taking our money but maybe we'll let him ransom himself back and get the money <laughs> Um, his heir doesn't really care for us too much. Probably could give him money just again. He's probably gonna be mad because we, uh, lock him up, but... Nice! Alright, so I have finished my education in the ways of war. I feel that I have truly found my calling. So now we are a brilliant commander. Awesome. So, we got Flanker, which I don't really like. Uh, Lightfoot Leader. I wish we would have gotten, uh, like Cavalry and you know, Inspiring Leader. That'd been a lot better, but oh well. We still can lead our wow, our marshal's thirty-two. I think it's uh let me see. Who has he probably has the highest marshal of any character. Let's see, it's put uh any religion. Yeah. He's got the highest marshal of any character. He even has more marshal than the damn dragon does. I don't even know where it's at. It has to be pretty low still because it's it's pretty young. There's even giants. <laughs> yeah, it's got 22 marshal. So yeah, we have the highest marshal in all the land. So the guy that's Lord of Orkmont just won under us. And then there's some ET guy. This guy's pretty badass, lonely light dude. He did have like 30 something. He lost one from Gout. So yeah, I remember him having 30 at least. So yeah, we're, we're pretty badass in the marshal department. We did uh, offer to join his war to help out. Uh, so yeah, we did that pretty much just for the extra opinion it brings us. 
I don't know what our focus is gonna be. I wish our stewardship was 18, or I think it's 16 that we could start a bank, but we can't do it. Um, I would like to get, search for a smith to get some, like, armor. Uh, we could become regent, become exalted among men. Our prestige is really low. Fall in love, become a higher lord. Honorary title probably be the one we can get the quickest. Since we're an adult. I guess she could have gave it to us already. She gave us Master at Arms at 13. Obtain a Dragon right now would be stupid because there isn't any. Uh, obtain Valerian Steel would be good. Let's just try the Honorary title for now. And then, uh, because we could get that, like, right away. Alright, um, War or Hunting? Which one should I go? I think maybe War. I'm trying to think of it. We shouldn't do Seduction or anything. Our, our Betrothed is only 10. So we got four gears for that. I'm thinking maybe just uh, war or health. I mean, or, or hunting. I guess right now we can do hunting. Just to have the extra health and we get the uh, the hunting events or whatever. If we get to the war, doing some kind of warring, then maybe we can switch it. Uh, This guy's way up there. I don't know why. The Norse in it, but I don't know what's why he's not moving his men up there. There's one man that are 8,000 are just sitting there where he could have easily went and taken these guys out. There's 3,000 here. I don't know if he's going towards them or not. Uh, we need a new regent. It's definitely not going to be that guy. I guess we're going to make our buddy here. Master Arms. He's been really good. He's made us a formidable fighter. He's given us good uh, martial teaching. So I don't see anybody better than him. Master Horse. Um, I guess we'll give it to Wallace or Atranta. Let's see, Cult Bearer. We'll get uh Clint Caswell as our friend, so is Ambrose. I guess we'll let Ambrose do it. Let me see if one of these Septons likes the uh sept the high septum more. Cause maybe it'll be enough to get them over the edge. This guy likes the high septum more, but it's not gonna be enough. This guy here. So let's make him the cup bearer. Hold on, he's not like he is ruthless. Hmm. You know what the hell is it? Alright, so he should like us more now than the hot septum. Where the hell's that guy at? How'd he go? That's him. Alright. So we'll get taxes from him. We get taxes from that guy. That guy we don't have enough. So we only got one septum that we're not getting tax money from, so that's not bad. Let's check our court. Yeah, we have 11 more spots in court, so that's good. We're not paying any expenses. I'm trying to see, our feudal tax is terrible. City tax, we're making a lot. And we make 77 a year. Our expenses are just uh, levy, main, uh, leech tax or whatever. Uh, Lord Mar Marbold of Manderford. Uh, yeah, there was just a war going on uh, for Sir Egon's claim. Did he take him? No, that's, uh, that's his mom yeah there was a uh a revolt where most of the reach uh was in it i know the florence were because the guy was a florent he's an egon florent he had a claim on the reach so they were fighting uh the tyrells for that yeah this guy was in it he was in it i think he's gotten everybody that was in it arrested <laughs> yeah oh that didn't work it looked like they had a chance because they had a good amount of people Alright, the dragon had another egg. Dude, this dragon's making a lot of eggs. It just, every time somebody tries to hatch it, it ends up just blowing up. It'd be great if the actual dragon gets hatched, but... Because we need to try to be able to go tame it. We got our, um... Our boats are made, but the thing is, the boats will not show, I think, until we completely fill up the levee. I know that's how it usually is. Says we have one galley right now, but it isn't going to show. Uh, Ed, or, Ed, or, Ed, whatever. Ed accepted King Annie's Ansel's peace offer. Uh, Peasant Revolt Rod Point is ended. Your acquaintance. Not my acquaintance. Alright. I really want to see Heron Hall restored. Alright. Time to deal with this asshole. So it's 65. I told him I was going to come after his ass for taking my money. Alright. Let's. God damn it! 
try to pause it and it doesn't pause. Uh, Lord John of Branston has declared Branston war for Prince Winton's claim on the Trotter. Who knows Prince Winton? Probably a, yeah, of course, a Stark. Why would you invite a Stark in to take over? Like, it doesn't make any sense. We're definitely going to help. I mean, we're on the Master of Arms anyways. We're going to raise all our men to help her out. Seems like Willowwood went against them. Uh, Turnbridge, he was her spy master because he kept trying to get me to uh, vote in his favor or whatever. And then Wayfarer's Rest. We should still be alright. We got more men than Cheetos right now. That's probably mostly our men. Let me see. Yeah, we got a lot more than the phrase now. Is it still Walder? Yeah. Alright, we need uh, a commander. It sucks that we're not going to be able to do it because we're training troops. Fucking Blood Raven is still alive. I guess we can make Blood Raven. I mean, he's got a lot of modifiers. He's a little old, but this guy's pretty good too. Let's just use him for now. Alright. First off, I want to arrest him. So we got 65% chance. If we take a uh, homeboy here, is my levy filled? Yeah. If I take him, put him over there, it might give us more of a chance. Who is it again? Lolliston, right? Yeah. Let's go ahead and move him to Lolliston. I think it takes a minute. There we go. Now you're in jail. <laughs> He'll probably die. So I wonder if I should just ransom him. You know what? We're authoritative. We're going to make sure he knows we're pissed. So they will call for trial. I just don't want him to freaking get, uh, be innocent. I can't just send him to the wall. But he did steal, and it was known, so he should be tried and convicted. But we'll wait till after we deal with this war, I guess. You know what? We can do it now. Alright. Who's my Castellan? He better do good. Alright, let's go ahead and raise our men and help her out. Uh, we'll at least raise the vassals. Oh! He's not gonna get out in time. Um. They're going to Haraway Town. They got full morale, so we'll take them out. Alright, this demand a trial by combat and summoning his champion to Heron Hall. Let's go ahead and, um. Let him run. Let's get these guys. Move them this way. But you're gonna go this way. Just so that other chap don't try to get you. That was like 600 men there, so I'm gonna have to raise them. I'm not gonna raise dairy men. Just because, uh, I need the ships to fill up. Maybe we'll raise Butterwell. Butterwell, Butterwell is almost, uh, completely full anyways. So we'll raise them too. Put them together. Wait for these guys to get down. The guards drag Simon Lawson up from his cell and throw him at your feet. I've come for justice, he says, by birth and blood. I demand trial by combat. Sir Jonah will be my champion. This guy sucks. Yeah, I'm gonna do the boss way I handle it myself. Trial by combat between Simon Lawson and Lord Anies is ready to begin. The court looks on tensely as you and Sir Jorah face Jonah face each other in trial. At the trial. You scan him for any sign of weakness, any opening in his defense you could possibly exploit. Um we're strong, so I think Yeah, we'll go by force. As you and Sir Jonah engage, you slip up and leave an opening in your defense. Jonah strikes to try to take advantage. What? No way, I'm not finished yet. Speed. <laughs> you see a weak spot. A vulnerability in Sir Jonah's defense. It's not much, but it's all you need. Sir Jonah tries to fight back, but I force my way through and move to effortlessly put the spear through his head. Finally, I thrust my spear hard into his chest. The surprise is clear on his face as blood fills his mouth. I must have hit something important. <laughs> Alright, so we killed him. 
We got lucky, Kanema's got us. I can't believe that, though. Dude was terrible compared to us. See, I don't understand what this two question mark symbol thing is, minus ten. Everybody in the whole Lawless, the Lawson family has had it. Like, even, uh, like, my brothers, um, my dad, like, everyone from Danelle had it. I don't understand what it's from, if anybody knows what that means. So we got bruise groin. Uh, it takes down our fertility and health. Not even a year. It's like a month. So we're already scarred, so big deal. You feel a sense of triumph as you drive your sword relentlessly at Jonah, finally striking a mortal blow and killing him. The gods have cast their judgment, and Simon Lawson is guilty. Uh, Lord Simon Lawson is found guilty by the gods. What punishment shall he receive? Um... I guess we will uh, probably just send him to the wall. Kind of sucks because we won't get money from him, but uh, like Sierra is my guest. Yeah, I think we'll send him to the wall. So I don't have to deal with him. We don't have to pay for that one, I guess. Uh, my lord, been tens of the wounds of your men at your behest. They seem to be much happier now, hearing that their lord will offer his men or his own maester to aid his men. Nice. Alright, let's turn down the speed a little. He is trying to siege down Haraway Town, so we're gonna have to deal with that. Um, I'm really thinking we probably raise Harrenhal men too. Because all these guys seem to start to, are gonna group up. I'm not gonna raise Derry though. I have to let that get built up some. Alright. You wanted it, here it is. So, let's just have these guys could since I raised them anyways we'll have you guys go there you guys go up you didn't really go nowhere so turn around and they're gonna come that way anyways all right now we're to take out that guy or Anies of Heron Hall's inherited castle Kingspire all right that's that other uh, castle can we give that to our uncle I guess he can hold it I mean I don't know though. Oh, he got remarried. Maybe he can. I don't know. Oh, you know what? We'll just make a new. Uh, might just make a new vassal. I don't know if he's able to hold it. I mean, there's no way if I'm only able to hold three, he can hold three too. Cause he's terrible. Um, yeah. Let's just give it to someone else. Actually. Do we have any friends in our court? Ambrose is here. We'll give it to Ambrose. King's Fire Tower. There you go, buddy. Even though it doesn't really do anything for me. <laughs> uh, let's see. What are you good at? You're good at Marshall, but you got a negative. Um, let's go er, with Diplomacy. Let's find you a Guardian. I guess Avon will do. Aegon's still kicking, that's good. Alright, let's put our commanders here. Well, I'll wait till they get together, because I think I'll put one. My lord, my scheme in the Heron Hall has borne fruit. I have discovered a plot where Lord Paramount Tormund Greyjoy seeks to kill Lord Damon of Dragonstone. Are you kidding me? You're trying to kill my dad? What's up with that? And your plot, asshole. Who's all involved? Just him. I mean, we don't want to see our dad dead. I mean, it would give us things, but... We're not like that. We like our father. Alright. Um, yeah, I don't think anybody will join it. Hopefully. I wish you could, like, uh, talk to the, uh, the king. Like, look, you need to get him to chill out. <laughs> How much money could we give him? 46. He'd probably, uh, ally with us, but he gets in too much shit. I don't want to be brought into his craziness. Alright. See, we have a direct leader, don't we? Yeah. Clayton Caswell. Then we have, uh, Stackley. I wonder if I should put Brendan. Brendan's a flanker, so that would help. Yeah, we'll put Brendan. Alright, let's let some of these other guys get up here, and now we'll go and deal with them. We don't have to wait for the other guys. If they came together. We still have more men, so we'll be all right. We're at a river crossing. It kind of sucks. Did he join a Liege Loyalist? Yeah, good job. This guy's done a really good job. Let's see. Uh, depose 
Lady Paramount, Gianna, Prince Errol for the Chada. Yeah, why do you want... I guess he makes sense because he's old gods. Uh, crown Loyalist. I guess we would be Crown Loyalist. Let me see. Is anybody on the, uh, the council? He's a justice here. He's not. Yeah. I don't see us being a... Uh, what's it called? Where the hell is the uh, Liege Loyalist? Yeah, let's just do Crown Loyalist. Actually, we're not going to get involved in anything right now. Let's deal with this war first. Alright, what do you want? <clears throat> you are just here. I think it would be beneficial to get a favor with this guy. Because he's a high lord. But usually I was getting like these little little lords wanting me to, to do shit for them. Alright, Lord Paramount Donner, the knight, declare Lord Paramount Donner's claim to try it again. This is like the third time he's tried this, I think. Baron tried to do it too. Alright, so we captured Homeboy here. We need to hurry up and ransom him before... Ah, oh, he doesn't have any money. Damn you. She's gonna ask for him, I know she is. Alright. Actually, it's good. You guys come back down to Heron Hall and get together. Uh, we gained an RA title, nice. So we got Master of Horse. Figured we'd get one, since we're already on the council. Alright, um... Come Regent. It's all my men fall in love. How old's our betrothed? Eleven. Build a ward chest. I think it has to get us up to... 500. Which wouldn't be bad, and then we'd get... Five years of national tax modifier. You know what now? Because I really want to spend the money on it, building up everything. We'll go ahead and try to obtain Blair and Steel. Even down the line, we'll end up getting Blackfire. We should, anyways. Uh, let him rot. I'm pretty. I'm pretty sure she's gonna ask for him. So, All right, Clayton, Brendan, Rob. Why did they put Rob instead of Stackley? I don't like the aggressive leadership. Yeah, let's have you instead. Alright. Let's go chase these guys down. Are we losing a lot of money? 1.37 right now. That's really good because at one point we were losing like 4. Alright, that war is over. So, we'll offer to join her in this one just for the opinion boost. Because it's basically helping. We're part of this war anyways, whether we like it or not. Alright. Like, I can actually raise like another thousand men from vassals who oh that's the one up there um let's get you going get you guys back at heron hall I'm trying to see here what is the neck doing the tyranny war all right um how many men does he have he has fifteen thousand she has nine jesus christ so she's gonna need our men anyways can i accept your offer of assistance you have no choice <laughs> Alright, your Septon Harlan reports that Septon Rhaegar Harrenhal has been humbled by your endless generosity. No problem. Hopefully we don't get an infected wound. Alright, let's head on up towards Freylands and uh... Man, it keeps changing out my man! Hold on. Unyielding is good for defense. So yeah. But aggressive leader takes away 10. Let me see. On you, yeah, they basically cancel each other out. He does have morale defense, ninety-nine percent. I guess we'll just leave him. He's just old. <laughs> All right. Um. Let me see. Who's other cats? He actually likes us, so we don't have to worry about him. We got two guys in our leech loyalist. Alright, we'll go up here. I really gotta keep an eye on where his main stack is. Which is probably that one. These reed men, though. I don't want to fight up. I don't have to. I'd like to go up there. Moat Kaelin and try to take that. But, she needs to keep her men with me. Or, vice versa. But she'll lead us into something stupid if I attach mine to her. Right, she's going to Greywater. We'll just go that way too. My lord, news from River on trial by combat. Lord John Perrin demanded trial by combat from his captor, Lady Paramount Gianna Tully, selecting Sir Oswald Page as his champion. 
Sir Oswald was defeated and forced to yield by his opponent, Lord Robert Piper, proving Lord John's guilt. As a consequence, Lord John was beheaded on the order of Lord Lady Paramount Gianna. Oof. Yeah, man, she's got such little troops. She's got a lot of gold. It's like high or something. <clears throat> oh. My work task bores me. Conversations with my courtiers bore me. Everything bores me. My master at arms suggests that I take up falconry to focus my mind. Uh, I think some hunting will cheer me up. How do you just send for a new falcon? Um, what's the difference? <laughs> uh, disastrous hunt. Um, yeah, I guess falconry will be okay. He says disastrous, like... What does, it, what does it mean by that? Am I gonna die? Usually it's just like it doesn't work out. <clears throat> Alright, good. Rabbit after rabbit was caught, killed, and brought to me by my new bird. It's good though, because then uh, we need some diplomacy boost. So if we get a falcon, we'll be pretty good. Alright. We got him attached, so now we should have more. I just don't want her doing it, anything stupid. Yeah. We'll just stay together. Hopefully she puts the other guys with us. And then we'll really be good. But we gotta watch out because the north has crushing attrition. Like we're gonna go through one that's 13,000. So we're gonna then 12. Until you get past the neck it's bad. So I'm thinking maybe we split until we get past it. Then again no. Because he's got 10,000 men going to Mo Kalen. Hopefully we just get into a skirmish and then we don't have to worry about the attrition so much all right here we go hope we don't lose too many men getting there I'm trying to see what the damn attrition is i couldn't see it damn so go get those guys like why are you gonna sit here and take attrition it doesn't make any sense come on that way <laughs> the new bird is almost too perfect i enjoy every hunt with her and the cook has trouble finding your recipes for rabbit so we've gotten falconer, which is good. We're losing men just sitting here. How many men do I have? 6,000. Come on. Please go after him while we have the advantage. We need to battle some points anyways. Uh, finances of the realm are in poor state. The trident has an urgent need of gold. So I hereby request you provide a loan for House Tully. Hereby request or are you ordering me? Yeah, it's good to have her as a, a favor. Five year loan at 20% interest. So she has to pay me back and we'll get a, a favor from her. So that's good. We're not losing but 0.23 now, so that's alright. Come on, man. Hurry up. If we take this rather quick, then the attrition will go away some. But it's taking forever to take a friggin'. Hold on. Why does it say. We have 20,000 here, or 19,000, but then it says we only have 13. Hers alone says 13. I don't know. All right, Lord Paramount Tormund, our has inherited, inherited the worship of Black Tide. That's good for him. Come on, hurry up and take this shit. Like, I hate this attrition. Donner Stark has had ice removed. Oh, he died. So now his son's taking it up. Artos. Alright, we got Scar. We already had Scar. Queen Raylanor of the Iron Throne has declared Queen Raylanor's claim on the Iron Throne on King Aenys the Handsome. Wow, she has almost 30,000 event spawn troops. He should have killed her. It was stupid. He had her locked up. He had to release her if she got away. Uh, we'll offer to join his war, too. Just because he's going to... No, he's not going to need our help, but... It's always good to get that extra opinion boost. Even if you're not going to help. This war is pissing me off. You need to go get him. She should have just assaulted because we're losing more men. Straight up sieging it. He's down to 8,000. If she goes and hits him right now, it'd be a lot of war score. Oh my god. And the attrition didn't do anything. I'm about to just take my men off. She has 7,000. 
I'm just gonna move these, you know, if I move them up there, he'll probably try attacking. At least I can bait him maybe to attacking her. And then we can come up and help. Some iron throwing men up there. Um, he's got eight or uh, six hundred here. Can he even siege this? No. Oh, he actually can. I would like to get down and attack him. If he brings these men up there with them, then I'll go after him. I don't want to leave her. Garth the Gallant usurped the uh, title High Lordship of Red Lake. The Rowans. How's the Osgrays looking? I always forget to check on them. Oh, it's a woman now. She has Cold Moat, Stanfast, and Weberton. Good for them. How many are alive? Three. She's pregnant right now, too, so she should have some more Oscars. It sucked that Duncan the Tall died so quick. I really was looking forward to using him when we got... I mean, it took us so long to get him, and then when we did, it was just, boom, he died in a month. <laughs> Alright, now she has more men here, so she can handle it. So we're going to go down and take these guys out, because we're not getting any battles. War score. She's actually our rival, too. He has the Reach, the High Septon, with his men. I don't know how many they actually have with them. Usually it'll say, uh, he has 6,000 men. Most of them are hired. And those are those guys, like, it says they're hired, but he's allowed to raise them for nothing. Uh, then he has Dorn slash Stormlands. She has 20,000 men. She should have way more men than it shows. Uh, there's the Crag who has 1,000, and then us who have 6,000. We had him as 8 at one point, but taking attrition. She's still, and him passing through here is making her take attrition too. Stupid AI does the dumbest shit. Since I came to River Run, I've never had a shortage of soldiers reinforcing our troops. We're training troops in River Run. They make sure there's no damn sicknesses. Alright, what's the next thing I have to do to up my uh, shipyard? So, I need to do Castle Town 2. In order to do Castle Town 2, I have to do private farms. So, that's 100. We'll wait a little bit. We're making a little bit of money right now. But. It'll go back down, cause I think because we were sieging. Oliver Rivers. This is uh, Kristen Wilde's kid. I think this is actually... No, I'm thinking of the wrong one. I'm thinking of the demon from the other series. Uh, he's good at martial. I think I'm going to do stewardship since he's got the double positives there. It's hard to pass them down. Alright, um, Brune's okay, other than the stubborn. I think we'll just go with him. Alright, I don't know why I'm paying for his education. We'll do very good. I'm not going to completely throw you to the wolves. Alright, this is assault. Take that back. Alright, it's at 35. It's going to take a long time. I guess we go back up and help. What's the... Is he the attrition? Uh, the supply limit is only 10,000. Let's go up. There's some of her troops. Where is she actually at? Usually they start them somewhere over there. She is married to a Kohorg. He's actually uh, the heir to Kohor. I don't think she's going to win, though. He's got 77,000 of his own troops. He's allowed to raise the Norse troops because they're at war right now. So he has that, too. Look at all them men. I don't know where most of her men are. Let's check her, uh, commanders. Some are in Rosby there. It seems like the rest are in Cohort. She does have 250 ships, but if she started here, it's going to take her a while. The boats are probably right over here, so she's going to have to sail around. By that time, who is this person? So that it is part of her troops, but she's not there. If he can capture her, it'd be great to end it right now. Oh, there's some troops. Let's go down and take them out. After we take these guys out, I might give us hopefully like ten more. He really needs she really needs to take him out while she has the numbers advantage of shit. Yeah, and that was another thing, I don't know if I mentioned he started colonizing old stones uh, a couple years ago. There's a man I need to arrest and another I want to assassinate. My spy master Sir Alaric could either help with the arrest or the assassination, but not both. 
Um, I think the arrest one. Oh! Did they just give up? What just happened? It just ended. It doesn't say why. It doesn't say white piece or anything. So what happened? Hold on. This doesn't make any sense. It just stopped. Maybe he com uh, he might have commanded him to end it. Let me see. Is she under him? It would say if so. Um, defending versus foreigners. Yep. Because they're Northmen. Whatever. That's good. At least he helped her. Alright. So we're still making a little bit of money. I guess we'll come down here and wait for the people to come. Uh, Lord Jamie of Goldbrook is trying to usurp my title. His just here, Master Christopher of Lakeshore, is supposedly traveling around Goodbrook, trying to find both documents and supporters to help him legitimize a claim on the title. You can try. All right, we reinforcing. So what? We'll go to Harrenhal or we'll go to Butterwell. So that way we're just sitting there reinforcing from our lands, and then when she finally gets here, we can get into the mix. She's got like 30,000 there, almost 20. There's another 11, another 20, another 21 there. He's got more than enough men. Maester Magor has come to me with a request. He wishes to make a journey to the Citadel in Old Town so that he may study for a link and increase his knowledge. The Citadel has promised compensation for the temporary loss of his services, if you agree. Ah, oh, yeah, it's only four gold. We'll travel to the Citadel, study for a link. He will be gone for several months. Alright. So, like, do we not have him for now? Like, who do we have instead? <laughs> we can't send for one. So, I guess we're just without him for a minute. The High Septon has declared an theme upon your acquaintance, Lord Paramount Garland. Man, he's going completely off the chains with this. I don't know how many people he's done that to since we started. So we're getting like four. Alright, here comes our ships. Let's see how many men she actually has coming off. Alright, Lord Aenys, for the good services which you have rendered to the Trident, I hereby reward you with substantial grants and incomes. I trust you will continue to serve loyalty. Oh, wow, 12 gold. Alright, 3,000 troops. Jesus Christ, it ain't even worth getting involved. It's already at 90. Let's just drop these guys. This is pointless. <laughs> he just wiped them out there. She took all her ships and brought them there. Lord Paramount Denny's of the Vale declared Veilman Northern to Jor were her sisters. So I was waiting for when this was going to happen. The North has been beat down from that war, so it looks like they're going to lose the sisters. Sword Maple. Oh, <laughs> uh, I'll give you diplomacy. I guess we'll stop here. Uh, where this guy come from? He must just turn 16. He's pretty good. Hold on a sec. Yeah, I think we're gonna switch him out for him. Alright, we'll stop here. Until next time, that thumbs up, subscribe. See you in the next one. Later.